In just under two weeks, as the 2022 FIFA World Cup kicks off, Qatar will welcome the world. Not everyone, however, feels equally welcome in a country where homosexuality is illegal. And today, World Cup ambassador and former Qatari footballer Khaled Salman did little to set minds at ease when he gave this interview to German television. This haram. Weißt du, was haram is? Haram, what's meaning? Yes, haram. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah haram, eine Sünde. So he would say for me, why are you doing it? But do you think gay is haram? Sie finden, schwul sein ist haram? Ja, es ist haram. Is haram. Ich bin kein strenger Muslim. Aber warum ist es haram? Muslim. Es ist ein geistiger Schaden. Because the damage in the mind. The comments provoked fury across the world. Football has come on a long way over the last decade in becoming a much more inclusive sport where LGBTQ plus people are recognized and respected. And the, the ambassador's comments just, just show that this is not a tournament for everyone. This is not a tournament where LGBTQ plus people are going to be welcome. Qatar! Mr. Salman is employed by the Qatari organizers, not by FIFA, but the interview will provide yet more discomfort for football's governing body, whose decision to award the tournament to the Gulf state has been widely questioned. At the weekend, Sky News heard directly from Qatar's foreign minister. We have our cultural norms, we have our society uh, uh, and what they like and what they don't like. We are not going to change the society for four weeks event. Yet we are respecting everyone and expecting from everyone to respect our laws. FIFA has begged teams to focus on the football. But that seems like wishful thinking, so long as the organisers themselves continue to court such controversy. Matthew Thompson, Sky News.